What's going on everybody? Right now I'm going to do a quick uh, Antutu benchmark score review with the Google Pixel 3 XL and the Xiaomi Mi 9T and I'm also going to go ahead and show you the Geekbench benchmark on both of these devices and see which one is better. So here I have my Pixel 3 XL which I absolutely love. I've had this phone for about four or five months and it's in my pocket almost every day. This is actually my daily phone. So, And here's my Mi 9T. Now this one has a notch up here with two cameras. This one doesn't have a notch. It's got a pop-up camera, which is amazing. I love the screen display on this one, the screen to body ratio. Uh, this one has a nice screen as well. I mean, they're both, you know, screens are both amazing on both these phones. This is AMOLED. This is also AMOLED with the higher resolution here, but that's another video. So we're just gonna go ahead and show the results here with the Geekbench and the Antutu. With the Antutu, we're gonna show that first. And I'm gonna open up both of them. Pixel 3 XL has an Antutu of 319,698, and the Xiaomi Mi 9T's got 263,019. In day-to-day -day use, this doesn't mean much because they both perform amazing. Uh, as I did with the iPhone 8, this one's slightly lower than the iPhone 8, this one's slightly higher than the iPhone 8, but all in all, they all perform pretty amazingly. So they're both fluid, they're both, you know, this one's stock Android. Nothing better than a Pixel as far as if you want an Android device. And now we're going to go ahead and do our Geekbench score here that I did. I'm going to do both of them here. So we'll get our Geekbench open here. And then we're going to get our Geekbench open up here and see what the scores are here. So on the Geekbench, the MI-19 has got a 541 score in the single and a 1712 in the multi. And here we have on the Pixel, we have a we have the CPU here, history, let's run, go into history here. It's got a single score of 514 and a multi-score of 2114. So the Pixel's got a higher multi-score, lower low, uh, single score, while the MI9T has a higher single score and a lower multi-score. That's because this one has six gigabytes of RAM and a 730 Snapdragon. This one's got four gigabytes of RAM and a 845 Snapdragon. So. So a slightly better processor, that's why the multi-score is a little bit higher. But all in all, these both of these phones perform exceptionally well. They're both running Android 10. This one's got the MI yeah, skin on it, the Xiaomi skin on it. This one's got the pure Android Google, which is the best um, as far as if you want a Google device. There's nothing better than a Pixel. So those are the scores, and I hope you enjoy this. And then just stay tuned for further content.